That's a giant. That's a giant. Oh, no. Are you serious right now? Holy crap. Oh my oh, god. Oh my god. <laughs> Another nice one on there. Oh I'll take this 20 and keep that all day long. Good morning guys and welcome back to another video today. So today I'm with my buddy Nick West here. We're on his Hughes Redfisher 18. Uh, so we're, gonna be, we're on a bigger boat today. And we're gonna be looking for a uh, redfish. What else? We got mangroves, sheep's head, black drum. We actually have, uh, yeah, maybe some snook as well. We actually are ready to go today. We got live fiddler crabs. I enjoyed fishing with those last time, so we're gonna do it again. And then we have some live mullet in the back. So not, not exactly sure what we're gonna start with and how it's gonna go. We might be all over the place with uh, what we're, what we're fishing for and what we're using, but I am gonna go ahead and try uh, a different technique today with the fiddler crabs. In the last video, I used the little uh, the little yellowtail jigs. A lot of people pointed out to try just a J-hook and free line them, so I'm gonna go ahead and try that today uh, for those sheep's head. But other than that, we're gonna keep a few today, and I've actually been practicing my catching cooks. So if you guys are fans of catching cooks, let me know in the comments because I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and try a few here. I've been practicing my cooking a lot, and uh, hopefully I'll be able to get those out here shortly, but enjoy the video guys. And uh, if you're new to the channel, please, please hit the subscribe button. We've been getting so many views, and it's like so many more views than subscribers. We could definitely get some more subscribers, but hope you guys enjoy the video. Let's get to it. All right, you guys, so we got our little fiddler crab here. I'm gonna start off with the fiddler crab. Nick is gonna start off with a live mullet, so we're just ready for anything. Um, but I got my little J-hook here. I like to rig them just through the side, kind of right through their leg and then out the back kind of their lower back just like that that should be the way to do it right there should work and uh look at that for a sheep said they would absolutely munch that but hopefully gonna bring, gonna bring a few home here today you ready nick yeah let's just hit these piling damn oh right there right there nice one real nice one yeah yeah yeah, yeah. No, nope, he's still there. Just don't move, don't move, don't move. Oh, yeah, that was him. I gotta hook set the crap out of these things. This is hard. Oh, huge one on that backside. He just came down. See him right there? Oh, I freaking threw him off. All right, okay. stay still. Oh, don't move, don't move, don't move. It's a giant. Pull that's, a, that's a giant. That's a giant. That's a beast. That's a beast. That's a beast. Don't just don't touch the trolling motor. Don't touch the trolling motor. Get the net. Get the net. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. As quick as possible. Oh! Dude, that's the biggest sheep I've ever seen. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Yes! <laughs> Holy crap! Oh my oh god! Oh my god! Are you serious right now? Oh, oh my, my god. god! Oh my god! Oh my gosh! Dude, I, keep the 40 inch snook. I'll take this 20 inch sheep set all day long. Dude. Oh my. Here, let me turn on the camera. Dude, that's the only sheep set I've ever seen in my entire life. Oh my gosh. How do I hold this thing? No idea. Kill him. Dude, <laughs> Holy crap. That is an animal. Absolute giant sheep said we're going to go ahead and measure him here. Uh, and then he's going to no clue what to say. This is the biggest one I've ever seen. Or, yeah, the biggest one I've ever seen. Biggest one I've ever caught, honestly. And uh, he's, he's going to go in the cooler here and make a super, super good dinner. Who knows? Maybe we'll make tacos. Maybe we'll make, uh, we can do a lot of different things. But stud sheep's head. Let's go. All right, let's get a measure on this guy, Nick. All right, tails on zero all the way to, ooh, 20, 20 and a half about. How about that? How about that? All right, in the cooler, open that baby up. I believe with the sheep's head, all you gotta do is go right here, yep. behind the spin. There's uh -huh. a really soft spot. Just poke your finger in there. That'll bleed them out. That'll bleed them out. All right. Oh, he's Jesus, dude, out. what? Enough of that. He just went up and bump, told you that the, the big ones, the big ones don't miss. It's never a question. They just the whole crab into their mouth. See a nice one on this back piling here. Got one? Oh yeah, he's definitely eatable. Good size, good size fish. Oh yeah. Eating on this back piling. Nope, he's going right after it. Yep. 
Nice. Yes, sir. Come on, slam. I'm insane. <laughs> I'm gonna try to swing this one. In the boat. In the boat. Let's go, Nick. Havoc. Number two. They swim, man, I tell you guys, they swim right at the fiddler crab every time. All right, sheepy number two of the day. This guy's probably gonna go 14, 15 inches, but good one either way. That was awesome meat. I love sight fishing them. It is so, so much fun to just see them uh, when the fiddler crab hits the water and they just turn, they go over there and engulf it. That's, that's an awesome thing. It's, it's like redfish or snook or sight fishing any other fish. It's very exciting, but uh, he's gonna go in the cooler here and uh, sick fish, let's keep going. Yeah, I think I got another one on this piling to the right of it. You see that shadow? It's a fish, right? Right there. Oh yeah, yeah. That's a little one. Ignore him. I think there's a bigger one on that back right pile, that back piling. I try and make it one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's small. He's, he's small, small too. Yeah, for the practice, perfect. Oh, I know he heard it. There you go. That's a good one. You're not. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> Welcome to fishing. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> I am the worst sheephead fisherman that has ever walked the face of the earth. It's okay, I've been practicing the past couple oh. of times. <laughs> Alright, but for uh, you guys who are watching the video who may be wondering exactly what are what we're doing here um we're basically just going up and down the docks very slowly keeping 15 to 20 feet off the dock and looking for those sheep's head that are nibbling off the the dock pilings just like this and then tossing a fiddler crab within you know there's one right there three four you see you one munching no i don't you go just to the right of that just barely i can just barely see him oh that would have been money oh yep there you go you heard him <laughs> And on top of that, you, you can actually hear them nibbling off the uh, pilings. They make like a loud noise that you can actually hear. We're like 50, 60 feet away and we can hear them nibbling on the on the pilings. You're due, Nick. Dude. Big hook set. Big. What's what's like Scott Mart or is it Roland Mart? Who's, who's Bill, Bill Dance, Dance hook set? Bill Dance hook set. You set the hook so hard on that one. That's the way it is. You could have pulled the hook right into his tooth and he didn't even then go in an inch. Didn't, didn't even pierce his lip at all. What else? Oh, forgot to mention uh, what gear I'm using today. I know a lot of people ask, uh, as far as braid, um, I'm using 15 pound braid and 20 pound mono. Are you the same thing, Nick? Pretty much. 15 uh, pound. 2500. Yeah, both 2500s we're using. Just light tackle. It's a lot of fun. And then our uh, little fiddler crab on our 1OJ hook there. It's a secret. Still very difficult though to catch these fish. <sighs> This is okay, Nick. This is all. There's another 20 inch sheep's head on this piling right here. We're freaking out because he is enormous. This is gonna be all Nick, all yeah, you, Nick. Put you the shot. All you, Nick. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Let it sink. Pick it up, pick it up, go again. He's not 20, but he's huge. Pick it up and go again. <gasps> money, 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 money. Yep, 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 he went in reverse. He's gonna go to it. Yep, you got him. I got a small one. Oh, you got a smaller one? All right, hold him tight. I'm gonna drop him in there. Jesus, that was a giant, dude. That oh, was a bitch. giant. Well, the little guy stole the uh, stole the crab, right? How big does he go? He's like barely 12, up to you. That's tough, man. Definite, easy 18 incher for sure. A 12 incher grabs it in the cooler. 12 incher stole it from the big one. He was, I'm sure in the video you guys could actually see that, but he was flopping all around on the piling. Dude, his whole back. His whole back was, yeah, out of the water, a full inch. Down there. Oh, there's a, there's a sheep. Go, go, go. Oh, money. Yep, yep, yep. Drop it, drop it. There's a bunch. Oh. Oh God. Get him. Boom out. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> Another nice one on there. Dude, right as you're like, it's slowing down a little bit. This one's a keeper. Get in. All right, well, there we go. We got another keeper. What is this, our fourth, Nick? Yeah. Okay. So we got him at 14. He's like close to 15, almost there. Decent one. Decent for sure. Almost had a double up there, Nick. All right. You can some ice on top of them. Yeah, hold on. Oh, 
so we got four. I believe the limit is six or eight per person. It's one of the two. Six or eight. We're not close to that uh, limit yet, but doing decent. Okay, I'll get my... Forget that, we'll catch the fish. No, I, I, I see what you're talking about. I was about to put the drone up, but Nick's spotting some giant sheep's heads. We're going to hold off for a second here. Oh, yeah, beast. Okay, but that's not the one I was looking at. No, Maybe no he way. Moved. Maybe he moved. He might have moved. Yeah, just slow around the right side. Huge one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, man. That's that's... Got, that might be him. No, that's not him. The tail we saw earlier came out of the water like four inches. Oh, you guys can see him right there. Get him. That's your perfect cast. Yep, yep, yep. Leave it right there. Leave it right there. Go again, go again, go again. Right now before he sees us. Just leave it like that, leave it. Leave it, he's gonna U-turn. No, he's not. Do you want me to hit him? No, no, no. Oh my god. Okay, go around the back, go around the back. Yep, 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 perfect, perfect. There you go. Nice. Can you swing him? Can you swing him? Yeah. I think. Oh god. Yeah, he's a good one. Yes, sir. That's a stud. That's a stud. All right, Nick. First decent sheep of the day. How about that? Finally. It's a good fish too. What do you think he measures? 16, probably. 15 or 16. 15. Nope, 16. Yeah, 16. Good fish. Good one. Good one. Oh, they want your cooler. <laughs> That's okay. You can always buy new ones. Beautiful. Yeah, boy. See, see what happens when you buy the merch? Check it out. <laughs> see what happens? Buy the merch, big sheepy chew. Dude, he's like... We gotta get this one. It's like 17 or 18. Keeps coming up and then going from piling to piling. Oh, there he is right there, there he is. Giant. Yep, yep, yep. Leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it, leave it. Yep, 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 yep. He had to have gotten it. Nice. Big one. Oh, yep, yep, yep. No! Did he break you on the piling? Damn, Nick. Oh, man, that hurts. Dude, he... He was 18. He wrecked me. Ouch. Dude, my drag was like fucking tight. It's all right, I'm sure there are gonna be more of just that size on all of these docks. That one had a lot of shade on that dock. Might have been a reason why they were there. Yeah. yeah. Right there. Oh, should you I stick him? No, I'll take him. Right. You can get the next one. Oh, that was Ooh, good. That was I landed good. on his head. He might still There's eat three it. Three in a row, right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One on every piling. Got him. Double. Yep. That's a good one. They might have just spooked because of this fish. See that that, pool, that piling right there? Front? Right here, right here. No. I'm gonna swing this one in. Right. Or I'll keep him in the water here. See if you can stick that one. I don't see him. All right. Go ahead. I'm, I'll swing him in. Yeah, he's a keeper. Yes, sir. All right, that is sheep's head. What? We got five today. Keeping number six, six maybe. He is uh 14. Yep. In the box. 14 in the cooler. They are showing up, Nick. You got sharp hooks? Yeah, gotta get on get on that mustad. Owner baby. Mustad. Yeah, those they could be little mangroves too. Can't really tell though. Alright, I'm gonna whip over to this next stock. Oh, I see him. I see him. I can. I can get. Eh, he looks little. You go. You go ahead. Oh no! Good one. Good one. Very good one. Perfect. Oh yeah. Oh, yep. Full speed at it. Come on. Just get. Be patient with him. Yep. There you go. Whip him out. Keep him tight. Keep him tight. <laughs> there we go. That's a. That's another good one. Here, I got you. I got you. Oh, is this big jacks or dolphin? I think it's a dolphin. There we go, Nick. That's the biggest. That's the big, your biggest of the day. Yep. Oof. Out of boy, Nick. Look at that. They even have like a little bit of purple in their in their scales. You see that? 
It's pretty cool. All right, on the ruler. See, this is your biggest of the day. Zero. Almost 17. Seven. Yeah, he's 17. I got him on 17. Awesome, dude. dude we are running out of room. Smoking him. We're running out of room in the cooler. See that pot? See him right there? Oh, oh there's our giant. Yeah, all right. Which one's all you? All me? Okay. Or me. Or me. <laughs> Go ahead. Okay. Got one shot. Don't mess it up because the little one's going to eat it. Money, absolutely money. Never felt anything. Did he go to the next pole? Right oh yeah, he's still right there. Oh, you know, no way, he just blasted off. He'll come back. Dirty. Yep, got him, got him, got him, got him. Uh, yeah, got him. He came back for it. Oh, that net's so hot. Yep, grab him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Yes, sir. Stud. <laughs> Let's go, Nick. We're killing him. Not really. You can mix some salt water in there to make it like a slush. If you have an extra bucket. Are we commercial king fishermen now? <laughs> yeah. yeah a little oh, Ooh, that is a stud. That's a stud, huh? yep. Zero. 17, another 17. Oh, he's so close to 18, though. Almost. So close. Oh, I can stretch. Dude, he, he's about there. He's about 18. Pinch tail? Pinch the tail. Yeah, pinch tail 18. <laughs> slide him up more. Yeah, right there. Oh, 100%. Yeah. 18 all day. Pinch tail 18. Ooh. Insane. Nice, Nick. Ooh. We're killing him. Killing him. All right, we're going to have to add some, some water in there to get it like a slush. Our cooler is not big enough for the amount of fish that we have. Oh my god, there's like 50 pounds of sheep. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so a lot of guys, or a lot of you guys were telling me in my last video to add salt water to the ice to make it like a, like a slushy basically. And it'll make the water a lot colder, which it is, it's super cold now. We got a lot of fish in a Yeti 35 here. What do we got, like 9 now? 9 yeah, or 10? I don't even know. Plus the 21 inch fish in there? Yeah. 20 inch fish in there? Oh yeah, they're doing good. We're solid. Straight, Nick. Let's keep going. Alrighty guys, well, two biggest fish of the day right here. The one I'm holding is 21, the one Nick is holding is like 18 inches. Um, and I caught both of them. Yeah, well. How do you feel about that? <laughs> you know, can't nah, get them all. I'm just playing. Nick caught a bunch today, we both caught a bunch. And uh, went through some fiddler crabs, we got a couple left. We're probably gonna go throw those around, see, see just what eats. But that's gonna be the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed that. This was an awesome day catching sheep's head. And uh, if you guys have any tips or comments, questions, leave them in the comments below. I'll try to get to just about every one of them. We're about to hit the stock, but that's all I got to say for today, guys. We're going to be cooking this up at home. Hopefully, I'll have some new catching cooks coming soon, and uh, see you guys in that next video.